Okay, this video is random as ever. I'm going to try not to jump cut just so I can really like power through this video. So there's my name, bottom corner. I just got in from work. It's about to go 12 o'clock. I haven't got time to set up the studio lights. Um, I'm doing night shift tomorrow night, so I'm trying to stay up tonight. Probably fall asleep. <sighs> Anyways, um, I'm going to try to do a little Christmas theme video sort of um, and talk about Krampus or Krampus. I always get wrong because I go Krampus. There's the first jump cut and I think I broke the light, tripping over it. Yeah, I always get grief because I go crumpus. And a bit crumpus. I'm like, I don't know, crumpet? I don't know. I always get like mixed up. Have you seen crumpus? Crumpet? Crumpus. <laughs> anyway, try not to jump cut. Got a lot of stuff to do tonight. A lot of videos. A lot of videos. Horror in the corn. Some 66. Ooh, it's part of an extra. Um, horror in the corn. Branches. Live in Philadelphia, there's a lot to do with this Christmas, <laughs> so I'll try anyway. Um, Christmas time, okay. Let's talk about Crumpet. Let's talk about Krampus. Now, Christmas films come along, and every now and again, there's some mental Christmas films like Jack Frost and um, Killer Snowman, which I get handy down here. Mental. I was, I was, I was absolutely freaked out the other night because I actually watched Identity going into the John Cusack video. And number two, I'm going to be working on soon. And the same writer, blown away by that. Blown away. The same writer, my god, I'm breaking everything. So while I'm breaking everything, I'll jump cut. Anyway, um, Krampus. Um, twisted story. Now, I had no idea what Krampus was until the film came along. It's not like I grew up on the story of Krampus. If you were bad when you were kids, Santa Claus didn't come. Now, is it in the folklore? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Kirkham is in the folklore. I think Kirkham is in uh, New York at the moment. Linda's Farm. They are definitely in the folklore, aren't they, Ned? So, so no, there's no Krampus or Krampus in the folklore of Britain. I really do a video about this. This was my late granddad's. Ooh, kill a seal. Um, it's my late granddad's uh, folklore book I found. Keeps popping up in videos. I don't think there's anything in the Bible about Krampus, is there? Do you remember this? This is the Holy Bible. This is the Mason Holy Bible. Um, if you've never seen the Holy Bible video I did, and if you read, just don't watch it. But yeah, this is a family one. It's me 200 years old. This has always been in this room. Always in shot. You just never know, unless you're looking for it. This found a um, really picture Bible as well. There's me wearing a Ghostbusters t-shirt. The real Ghostbusters. But yeah, well, me dressed as demolition. How old is this? So anyway, Krumpus is mental. Um, family get together and Krumpus comes to visit, sort of kind of thing. And it's mental, evil teddy bears, insane biscuits like gingerbread men. Funny, gross, dark, and it's just mental. And I tried watching it, I started writing a review for Fast Forward Reviews. I think this film is mental. Just mental. And it's just like, there's twists and turns and stuff like this where Krumpus like, ooh, like, ooh, creepiness. And um, yeah, better watch out. You better watch out. This film was nuts. Shh. So yeah, give it a watch this Christmas. It's not for kids. It's one of the ones where oh yeah, the kids are like it'll be fun. It's not for kids. Kill the teddy bears, gingerbread men. You want to behead them all the time. You know what I mean? Now the reason why I'm doing this video is I got myself on a new pop vinyl, and just like my Pennywise one, the Chase one, which is still up there hiding away, it happens to be a Chase one, and it is Crumpet, Krampus, and he's red. I know but this light in this room is not going to justify it, but that is a massive difference in the chase. He is red, he doesn't have his little Santa Fit, Santa Fit, uh, Santa Fit outfit on, and uh, there's no like gingerbread man there, but we're going to have a look at him. That thing is now not going to shut up. So on the back, just a bit like the Pennywise, you just have the Krampus on there, and the Devil Incarnation holding kids up at the back there. Uh, collect them all, there's only one, there's one, it means all the pop vinyls, impossible. Someone out there has probably got all the pop vinyls in the world. Inside, um, let's have a quick peek. He's actually quite big for the box. Um, wow, he's awesome. So away from the box, he is red, and the other one's out. He's got his little broomstick there going on there. Wow, I didn't see that. He's got a kid in the back. That is quite creepy. Little kid peeking out there, like a little mini pop vinyl at the back as well. Little red tail, little devil horns. Reminds me a bit of a uh, Momra's mutt. M Marmot, 
So that look, I know Marmot and remember Marmot? There you go, Marmot. You know, I was I just want to remind us of oh, Marmot and head doesn't twist. There's a lot of pop files now with the bobble heads. It's not the same, you see them and like they've got the whole springs going on underneath the neck. Like stripe, wobble wobble. I mean you can't see stripe spring but the pop files now they're all wobbly and stuff like that. It's not what really but pop file pop blah 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 blah. I can't even speak pop finals, but he is awesome. I really do like him, and I just thought he'd be cool sitting on the shelf. It's kind of mental to walk in the stone. Whoa, there's a pop final there. Fine. <laughs> so, yeah, grab that. Thought it'd be cool to get him at Christmas time and add him to my collection. I've been on a buy and ban from Annie for a while, and I didn't think anyone would get his crump Crumpus. And I didn't even think I would ever do a review for Crumpus. I have wrote one, just never got around to filming it. But yeah, back there, it's a really dark film. Um, it's a universal, it's a big budget movie. There's a lot of different Crumpus movies out now, but this is a, definitely the big budget one to watch. Coming down there, twists and turns, gory, bits in the snow, it's quite creepy. And yeah, if you haven't seen it, definitely check it out. So enjoy your Christmas films. Best Christmas film ever. It's the Gremlins, isn't it? Isn't it? I'm talking to you. Yes, you. I'm talking to you. So, yeah, best Grem Gremlins film ever. Best Christmas film ever. It's Gremlins. Home Alone. Jack Frost. Die Hard, Take the Holes, Monty Python and the Holy Grail, this video is going to go on forever. Merry Christmas, thanks for watching, Crumpets goodbye. It just tipped, hey, what's going on here? What the hell? Could be typical that the first present open for Christmas, what's going on here? Is Maltesers? Maltesers anyone? How do I get out of this? Eh? What am I going to do with these Maltesers in this bubble? What's going on? Help?